Hey guys, Brody here. Welcome back to TCG Card Shop Simulator. Here we are for um, episode, I don't know, 11? I think it's 11. Day 70 anyway. Um, let me quickly just check. Max cash. Why is it showing me people's max cash? Uh, custom customers. Auto enter credit amount enabled. Uh, yeah, I don't want rollover custom info. Um, set to true to auto pop out credit window with the correct amount default true. I don't know what that means. Anyway, now we look at someone. Yep, nothing like that. Okay, cool. So day 70, 8 a.m. We've got 30,000 in the bank. Um, I've got smelly customers back on, which is a suggestion from some of you guys. Now there's been an update as well. There's now tabletop um, games. Um, uh, two, yep, so what's that? One, two, three, four, five. So I don't know where we're going to put these. Um, system Gate, System Gate 2, Mafia Works, Necromancers, and Claim. I don't know if these are legit games in real life or not. I'm not 100% sure, but let's um, do some expansions, I think. Yeah, we're going to have to do at least two more of those. Right, a note, one more. Reno Big, let's get this one, two and a half, perfect. So that gives us a little bit more room. I know a few people said these wire racks look a bit dodgy. Um, I get what you're saying. I think we're just gonna have to wait and um, see how we go with um, what else those plushies could possibly fit on. Um, what else new do we have to unlock at the moment, I think? Yeah, we have the Rare Destiny packs. Okay, so we'll get you and we'll get you. Um, I want to get, uh, actually, I think it's, yeah, so four and then eight. Oop, not you. Get out of there. Um, let's go four, no, eight, and then four of you. Done. We'll order those in. Alright, and then we'll look at the tabletop gaming stuff after this, but let's get all this stuff on the shelf first. Before we um, open up the shop. Right, bang, bang, there we go. You'll restock that. I'll uh, throw you back in there. Where is the other box gone? Over there. Okay, so you're going to go uh, in there, so you know where to put that. I'm going to put you there, so you guys know where to put that. Right, so they'll hopefully start putting those boxes away where they're supposed to go, and then we'll um, encourage them to put these things where they need to go. So they can get the restocking done where we're doing other things. Alright, throw that out. I think, do we have... Actually, let's go accessories. What else do we have down here? Uh, we've got you, we've got you. So nothing else unlocked in here that I can see. Now that's level 50. We've got all those. I believe we've got all those. Yep, to the yellow. Yep, we've got all those. Um, figurines. 5,000 for you. So that's our next level for the Inferhog figurine. I think we'll wait until we get all this unlocked, I guess. Level 50. Yeah, then we'll go from there. So any other stuff we've got now is the tabletop. Tabletop stuff. And I don't know what I'm going to put these guys on. Just order those though. Um, look at DIY. Like I was thinking we could probably go with a wide shelf, which is a double-sided shelf for the tabletop games. So I don't know how they're going to fit like on these shelves. And if they, we do put them there, it's only going to be temporary anyway. Um, so what's a tabletop? Uh, so you go there. Necromancers. Actually, no, you go there. And then it's the Mafia. I think is that one. And then you. Oh, yep, so the blue yellow mafia yep cool all right so let's go and check on how these fit on the shelves so only two on each shelf right, i'm gonna put you down there 
not sure on how I feel about how these are going to go on the shelf. There's only two on each, which probably doesn't matter too much, but... Oh, I'm used to playing other games, pressing the E to try and pick things up instead of just the left mouse. Right, so those guys are all threes. I don't want to put him in there because it looks a bit dodge. I think even those shelves, I think they're going to be the same. Right, so you fit there pretty well. I think I want to look at that other shelf, that table, and then we'll sort of just have a look at how they fit on there. This is 12. Okay, so you're a double anyway. All right, beautiful. Throw you down. We've got five and a half grand still, so let's bring you in. Two and a half grand still. Right, have we got enough room to fit this back here? We do. Okay, so we can probably fit two of these in if we need to. All right, boom, grab you. Right, one, two, if I go no, there. Don't know if that's going to give us six on there. Potentially it will. Yeah, I think that's going to give us six. Mafia works down there. You've got an extra one, so that's not going to work, I don't think, for down there. Yeah, that's a bit of a bummer for those. I mean, it's it will make it work. All right, throw you down. So I'm thinking we're going to need two. So five, 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 five for these. Five, five, and five. What are you? You're eighteen. Six, twelve, eighteen. But we need uh, fifteen. So we still need three. Three of you. Um, you're gonna need one, two, three. Four. Six. Six of you, I think. Uh, 1,600, yep, yeah, good, we can get that done. Right, how much is our 1,000 for the big warehouse? Okay, because I want to... I want to be able to get the big warehouse thing. Let's open up while they're doing their thing. Right, I'm going to get these thrown. Actually, ah, oh, shit. Right, get rid of you, 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 and you. Grab that so we know where these guys are going to go. We grab you and throw one over there. I'm going to hit F5, make sure they're doing their thing. Right, done. Let's throw these boxes out. I hope they're going to dispose of their empty boxes. Right, there's the extra thousand that we need for the storage. Right, so I'm hoping those smelly, when they spray the smelly things, that counts as me spraying them as well. Right, so there's been a decent update, as I said. Um, just giving us a new tabletop games. Um, I think it's increased the way, improved the way these things work as well, which is really good. A few minor little adjustments, but um, as you guys know, when I record, um, why did you just dump that on the floor? Sometimes I record well in advance. Oh, that's why. Okay, well, now I'm just going to put you down there for now because I will open you. Uh, what the hell are these guys? Got stuff everywhere. Okay, yeah, there's... I remember I brought a whole heap of extra things. I'll throw you over there. Throw you over there because I want to get a shelf for the tabletop. Tabletop stuff. Right, bring that in. Obviously, this isn't going to be its permanent home. So what I'll do is I'll just move it over and we'll stick it there. Uh, we 
which one are you? Yep, you're good. Okay, so we'll go you there. Uh, you're the fourth one, I believe. Then we've got Mafia as number three. You're number five. Right, Mafia number three. Yep, and that way they can put things back on the shelf. Uh, which one am I looking for? Not you. Not you. Uh, the yellow. It's not you either. This one. Right, you can go there. I'm going to throw you down there because we're going to need extra spaces. I don't know if I've brought too bloody much now. No, I haven't because I haven't restacked the back of the shelves yet. Okay. Right, so you can go there. And obviously they will do their thing. Uh, the blue one, so this will go in this other side. Matches those, and we've got Mafia and then Necromancer. Getting stuck on everything there. Uh, Mafia, beautiful. Mafia can go on this side. Pretty out, we'll grum in and grab the Necromancers. There you go, because you just dump them on the floor. Perfect. God, it's so annoying they just dump things on the floor. I'll throw you in there. Throw you back over there. Eventually that'll get put back on the shelf properly. Right, so those guys should get restocked. So $49 for one of those. Okay, so that's... We sell one, we're like $7 profit. It's like $56, $57 profit. When, when we sell two, obviously. Right, I'm going to put you there. Let's open up some of these guys, because these are new. I don't know if I've turned down... I don't think I've turned down the speed yet. These are all going to be new. $21, beautiful. Right, can I go settings? Let's turn that down a bit. Right, open up these whole packs and see if we can get some something good. I'll have to go through our um, folder as well and show you guys the best cards we have, like our front page, and just let you guys know what the value is worth. I've been opening a ton of cards. There we go, 123. A full, I think that's called an art an art card because it's got no border. Uh, we've been opening a ton of packs. You can see on the left hand side, total packs opened 3847. That's a mod that I've downloaded which tells us how many packs have actually opened in total. So that's probably low compared to a lot of people, but we've been smashing out the um, the cards. Right, nothing overly great yet. Two bucks sixty, sixteen cents. Another one that's not overly great. Bordos seven twelve. Le Flair, Le Fire. I do love these cards. Now there's lots of mods available as well, um, which have put like Might and Magic and Pokemon cards and stuff in instead of these cards. I'm not keen on doing that. I'm only trying to put in mods that sort of just help us as far as workers go, just encourage the workers to walk faster. Um, make it so we don't have to pay them $10,000 to bloody hire them, make them work a bit faster, walk a bit faster. And I said paying them $10 an hour. Maybe that's not enough. Maybe we should be paying them $20 an hour. I don't know. I know I've had one comment so far saying that ten dollars an hour is just not enough, so we may have to bump up their salaries by double from twenty dollars an hour. Um, yeah, I don't know. We'll wait until we get further in game and work out how much we're how much money we're making. We're making a ton of profit. We should sort of help share with our employees. Now, one mod, either one mod that I would like, or one thing I would like the developers to put in the game would be an easier way to order stock. Um, 
So I'll show you what I mean in a second. It's got um, candy and toy store simulator allows us to do this, which is bloody perfect. Um, you just go over to, oh, I see the bottom left-hand corner, we've got the little bat there. If you left-click or middle mouse button or whatever, add it direct to your cart. So right mouse would remove the sticker from the shelf. Remove label, left mouse click would add it to your cart. That would be perfect. It would be so easy to be able to do that. And then that would just allow us to be able to um, click on everything we need and then just order it in one big go instead of going in and out, in and out of all the bloody menus like I do when I'm trying to make sure everything's ordered and in stock. That's, that's one quality of life thing that I'd like to see. I think that would be a huge improvement for anybody playing the game, but especially people like me that love to make sure I've got a ton of stock. But as you can see, my stock room today was completely full. I had every single shelf had as many boxes on there as we could just to make sure we had enough stock to get through each day. Um, at the end of each day, I'll order everything we're missing. So if missing two or three boxes, I'll order three boxes of this or two boxes of that, whatever it may be, just to make sure our stock room's full, as well as out the front, all the customer stuff is completely full. Right, let's go out and check our cards because I yeah, so no doubt we're bloody nearly empty. Click on duplicates as well, which gives us um, duplicates and it sorts by our best price as well. Oop, that's lucky hands full. Right, so throw all of our duplicate cards on. Two of you, one of you, two, and we've got heaps of you. I'm gonna hit F5 as soon as I put all these guys down. Right, we need one more. Oop, no, not you. Put you back. Right, back to you, there we go. F5, let's get that light turned on. You can see one of those is gone, so if I pick you up and put that in there, that'll refill it completely, which is good. How are you guys going with stock? It's getting there slowly. All that stocked, ready to go. We've got six grand in the bank. I'm um, still level 32, so I don't think there's anything else we can really do. Level 40, 50, okay, 33, 45, 39. So it's still going to be a while before we can get these guys. We'll add those when we can. So let's go through our folder and go for our price, and we'll go over our best card. So we've got the F Mamo Tree Full Art Legendary Foil, 3,802. We've got the Bonfiox Full Art Rare Foil, Two and a half grand. The Magnoria EX Legendary Foil, uh, which is the Flamey Full Art Common Foil. The Guppy Full Art Common Foil. Worm Ghoul Full Art Common Foil. 18 to 1700 bucks. 1600 for the Lufire Full Art. So the Full Arts are worth quite a bit. Um, the Bogan, or Bogon, I should say. X Legendary Foil, 1500. 1400 for the Draconix. Uh, this one, the Prince Star, a thousand. Clawop, eight thirteen, and seven forty four for the Crab Locks. So it's still got a decent amount. And Forty two and a half thousand. We have. All right, get these cards on. Forty two and a half thousand dollar value, which is pretty good. I'll put that away. Right, there's nothing else that we really need to do. I'm hoping they're still going to continue to get those on the shelf. I might need to even change change this up. So put you down there. Get rid of that. Put you there. Get rid of... Yeah, there we go. I think we need four, four, and four. Then you guys are full. Put... Oh, that's right. Yep, okay. So four of each except for four, 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 and then three of you. Beautiful. All right, let's, that one will throw you in there. So that way I can have four of each. Uh, Mafia works, which is there. So they'll bring those in and stick them on the shelf. What the hell are you? Uh, you're that one. Obviously, still no more space. A ton of you as well. That's just an empty box, I think. 
Got nothing left in there. Right, so Caspers are going pretty well. We're still making we're making a decent amount of money every day, which is really good. Um, I'm still not sure and these the plushies. I don't really want them on here. That's only three high, and the thing with that is there's four different plushies available. Maybe those, those, those on these guys, because there's three different ones, and then the other, like this, these original plushies can stay in the racks, maybe, or even just in one of these each. I don't know how that's going to go in there. Like, I think I can only put three in there as well. Yeah, that might be all right if I get that in there. I don't know. Oop, put that in there. Oh, I, I did take that off. And then you're still going to put him in there anyway, are you? <sighs> um, where are you? You've got a full. You're full. I need the empty box. Give me this. Get that off there. Put you back in there. Um, put you back there. Beautiful. He won't do that then. Yeah, I don't know if we keep the original ones in a full full wire rack, or if we do three of these as the plushies, and then we do two tables. Two tables. That'd be one table, wouldn't it? Yeah, one, two, three, will be one. No, it'll be three tables. Yeah, because we'll go one, two, that'd be, yeah, two tables. And then you can put those other plushies in the middle. Uh, what's wrong with you? No idea what's wrong with you. Uh, which one? You're all... Actually, one, two, three, four. I need an extra shelf here. Realize what I've done. Throw you off there. I'm going to put you up there. I know what I've done there. We need a whole extra shelf if we're going to do that. Two, two, two. That, and then we've got... Oh, yeah, I don't know. Small warehouse that that gives us one two three four that only gives us two. Got four. That's got three. Yeah, I don't know what to do about that because I'd want each of those and have that be on its own shelf. But obviously we just I don't know where we'd put it. Maybe just stick it over here for now. We'll work it out later, I guess. Get rid of you, put you up there. Yeah, we'll work that out later, I think. Right, throw you down there. Mafia ones will go down there. Go there, and then you can go there, and then that way you can go back there. No, they're back to front. There, back to front. Oh, get out. Ah. Throw you down. Does it really matter? It doesn't. That's better. Blue, the yellow. Yep, cool. Right, I've still got guys playing. Got a guy sitting there by himself with all his friends. Right, so we can also go from this into Destiny. We've got some better destiny cards that we can possibly sell. We need to sort of change it up. Alright, well, let these guys check out. This guy can get out of here. That's all full. Um, the only other thing, double check, the only other thing we haven't unlocked yet. We've got you, we've got you, we've got you. Haven't got these guys yet. Accessories, we've got all of these guys. 
Um, did I? Yeah, I unlocked those. I haven't got that because we can't get it yet. Levels. The only figurine we don't have yet is this guy. Yeah, so we're quite a ways away. Plus, this one is like a whole extra action figure, which I don't know what we'd put that on. We need That needs to be on like its own little round table or something. I don't know. Alright, these guys are completely finished. So this is where I normally come in here and I'll have a look. So we need one of you, one of each of those, but being able to click on this and being able to order from there will be so much easier. We'll just save a ton of bloody time, I think. But anyway, let's end the day. See how we did. 13 dissatisfied customers. XP gain 43. 24 cards sold. 268 items sold. Um, item earning 5.6. Card 600. And nearly 4,000 in game earnings, which is really, really good. Um, we lost nearly 23,000, obviously. But we gained 10 grand in revenue, which is bloody awesome. So we're making 10 grand or more a day, depending. Obviously, minus stock and... Uh, wages and all that sort of thing. So let's, well, that's bloody expensive. $2,000. Boom. There goes all of our money. What are you doing? You're getting ready to serve. Perfect. Right out, guys. Well, this has been another episode of TCG Card Shop Simulator. Hopefully, you guys are being enjoying it. If you have, as always, smash that like button. If you guys have got any ideas, suggestions moving forward um, for like shelves and what you guys like to put certain things on, let me know in the comments section below. Um, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. It's been Brito. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again when we hit day 80.